Someone. It's like the guy's tag is actually someone. Oh, this is Mojo. Mr. All Mojo right, so Rising. Mojo Rising versus Salacious B. Crumb right now. And let's get So we're still it. getting Ness. Yeah, can't get enough of Ness. I guess not. All right, guys, so let's see how this one's going to turn out here. So I'm not sure. The only the only matchup experience I've had with Ness and, and a sortie is in Project... <coughs> So we're gonna see what's gonna happen. So see what's gonna happen here. How the matchup is gonna be like that. So, uh, so, 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 folks watching at home, um, what do you think of this matchup? What do you think of this matchup right now in Ultimate? Well, Ness is gonna get spaced out with Fairs, Nairs, Bears, Side Bs, <laughs> and the Kitchen Sink. But at the same time, Ness has Disjoint. This, yeah, he Ness has, has some so much Disjoint. Of his own. Oh yes, he does. Trying to go for the up tilt. All right, here's that spacing that you wanted. Yeah. Oh, uh -oh. that's basic. Oh, we tried to GameStop trade with it and does not get it. Nobody home. Oh, not going to be able to punish that. No nope. punish off of that, like, rogue up B. Can we get the Nair good clutch trapping here? Fair. Does he have his jump? No, he doesn't. He's done. And the counter yep. for good measures. I don't think he was going to make it, but, yeah, good coverage from uh, Mr. Mojo Rising. Yeah, just to make sure. Oh, yeah. F tilt. Let's see how this one's going to go. Oh, uh, boy. Yeah, get up attack is actually one of the very few options that actually beats out uh, Ness holding yo-yo in oh, down smash yeah. or up smash. Because the iframes on it are all the way until it hits. Yeah, which exactly. It's a huge buff for get up attack. It's so nice. It used to suck and now it's actually you could use it. <laughs> oh yeah. Uh, yep, there, there it is. There it again. is again, yeah. He he's he's gotta he's gotta find a way around this. If he if he if he can get condition him to get up attack. Yeah, he, 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 he but Mojo smartly not doing the same option, but the back throw gonna Ooh. kill. Yeah, Ness gonna back kill. Back throw, crazy strong. Down tilt. No, nothing after that. Yeah, I don't think that dash tag was intentional. Cause I don't think so. Oh no! Oh, oh. missed the punish. A lot of missed punishes here from uh, both Slash Speed Crumb and to a degree. Um, ah, missed the tag there. Mr. There. Mojo Rising, but at the moment I say that, goes for the clean up B and take the stock right now. This Nair and take the grab. Okay. Mr. Oh, Mojo Rising. He's crazy. He's crazy. Oh, and my. He's going to pay for that. He kind of wants to get, like, the mental guard break right now, trying to push trying to push us. Like, we come to just play on tilt from game two. Yeah. It's like, if that worked, he would have looked insane. But if it didn't, he would also look horrible. Like, if he like, lost this. Yeah. But, but he wins. He wins. He wins. He gets that. All right. So, Mr. Mojo Rising now. Unfortunately, that's more mental damage, I feel, to, to uh, be crumb because... Kind of messed. He, he, he kind of got an input error right there, and along with that, he was in a very like hard to get out of situation. So unfortunately, so unfortunately, uh, B Crumb's gonna lose game one, and Mr. Mojo Rising gonna keep it going. But all right then. So we're gonna see the switch to. Uh, he does inkling. have an inkling? I know he does have an inkling. Actually, I do remember like seeing that while like during like the 72 hour event and a couple weeks after that. So we're gonna. So um. Will be. I think I'm not sure about the switch to Marth. I guess like Mr. Mojo Rising like thinks that like he'll be able to get more like tipper hitboxes out of uh, out of uh, side B or out of, out of just uh, in general. And I can definitely see that. And especially with a stage like Smashville, I think the, pl the platform just is in main tipper range, just from up tilts. Yeah, I can actually see that. All right, good fair, but recovery is actually pretty good for Inkling. And that's, and that's the tipper. Nope. There we go. That's a stop. That's another tipper. Oh, oh yeah, this jump. The, now he used the side B. So side B actually allows you to get a second jump, right? Yeah, it allows you to like do a little hop. So it's basically another jump. Oh, okay. So Inkling's recovery, good. <laughs> Look at that ledge play also from uh from Mr. Mojo Rising actually. Like I managed to clip him with the up B and dodge out of the way from the F smash. We that is not good to this, say the very least. This song always infuriates me. Like this, <laughs> it's like you ever play Monopoly like on the phone, like the mobile version? Uh, this is what it sounds like exactly. It's okay. crazy. The <laughs> you gotta put a side by side, dude. Just listen to one and then the other and be like, whoa. I got you, Copyright. man. Copyright. I got you, man. But hey, but hey, look, looking at the game right now, um, Salacious B. Crumb managed to actually get some offense started, but yeah, he's showing that he's getting these tippers. He and yeah, no, Mr. Mojo Rising yeah, the making me eat my words and showing him how like legitimately good his spacing is with Marth. But at the same time, there's one situation where Lucina would have been better. Oh yeah, definitely. He would be dead right now. Oh yes. 
Just trying to close out the stock as much as possible, though. But as I say that, so this B Crumb was getting some offense started, but get up attack into fair. No death yet. Death yet, but up tilt? Yeah. That's I'm gonna do it. I'm actually surprised yeah. that the lightning didn't show up there. I don't even think that was. I, that was, was definitely. That tipper? I don't think it was a tipper. It would have made like a different sound. Uh oh. But he has a jump. I mean, see. he was at very high percent. Yes, that too. All right, down throw. Good tech chase from both from uh from Mr. Mojo Rising. All right, so let's see. Let's see how this one's gonna start up. Essentially, dash attack. Yeah, that's that new tech. Uh, the, what is it? That's the skid animation. You cancel the skid animation with a forward tilt, and you actually slide a little bit. It's, okay. it's pretty useful. That's cool. Yeah. Good nair gets the tipper. So get some off stage. Great spacing, but ooh. nice parry. But the S smash is gonna be too slow. Oh yeah. Tries to get the roller. Okay, air dodge is out of that scary situation. Oh, try to go for a rogue, rogue uh, neutral B. Nothing yet after that. Okay, gets the fair, gets the fair right now. Mr. Mojo Rising trying to close out this set, this stock right now. Trying to take, trying to keep the momentum going. He has 133 coming up on the come up right now. Tries to get the up air through, through the stage. Anything after that? Again, look at this bear spacing, this bear harassment too. Wow. Okay. Oh, oh. my. All right. That was just unga swing. <laughs> Gonna get another back air, but Inkling does struggle to kill if she doesn't get roller. Oh yes, she does. She does. All right. Up throw. No. Not yeah. Yet. No. Just attack on the damage as much as possible. Tries to get the F to two frame, but, but the forwarder is gonna kill. 143 on it. 143. It's, it's still a tough, tough climb. But uh, down throw. Oh, counter. nice try. <laughs> yep, straight up. Trying to get the ledge trump. Nothing there though. Yeah, good awareness by Salacious actually knowing that Ooh. he's gonna trump again. Buffers a rule. And and make some buffer the counter. Good punish off of that. Again, just a long mountain to climb right now, but. Yeah. But still pretty doable. This is this is becoming more and more doable as we speak. And oh, that's, that's it. it. Wow. You know, they you know, they know that you you that we both have to like get off after this. <laughs> so they're they're just trying to milk they're just trying to milk the fact that we're on commentary right now, it seems. <laughs> oh wow, that was a very good comeback. It was at 140. 140, 140. yeah. 140. That's so it's so, all right, they're running it right back to Smashville, though. Again, Salty I, run back. Salty I, run back. I agree with that, but are we going to see Lucina or Marth? Okay. He wants to do one of each. He I, wants to win one with Lucina, one with Marth. Yeah, exactly. All right. I Again, I understand this because the platform, honestly, is just, like, near tipper range, essentially, on, uh, on it. So, like, he can punish legitimately anything right now. So let's see if there's gonna be any like any like adjustments right now. Um, Slicey Crumb getting first blood it seems right now. Yeah, getting that good up throw combo, up throw up air, the classic. Oh yeah, ooh, waking up a little bit. Slicey B Crumb, Slicey B Crumb getting on the offensive right now. Seventy percent. Nice up air. reaction. Up air, nothing after that though. Back here, uh, Mr. Mojo Rising trying to regain that momentum he just lost. Oh. He's got to up back the stage. He's making a back dog. Yeah, he had some, had some good swings off there. A oh, little yeah. bit of an edge guard, but not quite. Not the, not the hitbox he wanted, though. Oh. Okay. Tries the anti air with the up smash. And nice response from Mr. Mojo Rising, just down air there. Yeah, that's the mystery, you know. Yeah, you're, I guess. You're up there, you just land with down air. Nobody expects it. No one expects the random uh, no neutral B. In fact, Mojo Rising has not been utilizing as much. I know it's unsafe, but along with that, nice. Slicey B Crumb has not been staying in shield as much. So you know what? Anything's possible. Don't punish off that up smash, though. So unfortunate. Try to go for the up. Try to go for the up B. Nothing after that. The 150% on Mr. Mojo Rising. He really misses that. The splat bomb bounces off him, and actually. If it didn't, if it didn't bounce, it definitely would have hit him on the on the. Oh, and weird angle, good. but he's gonna make nope. it back. Up B is broken for some reason. <laughs> oh, the fair cross stage still gonna take it. Oh yeah, and what? Salacious taking the lead here. First time in the set. All right, nice back air. I like the delay, trying to trying to make him poke out of it. And this is where you know Mojo could be really hitting himself. 
Oh, we're picking Mark because plenty of times the consistency of Lucina would have taken the stock, but not the tipper, but that's the tipper. That's the that's tipper. The tipper. That's, <laughs> the, that's the stuff <laughs> that's right it. there. I try to go. All right, now, so neutral is now reset. 17%, not, nothing too hard for Mr. Mojo to, to bring back. And look, he's bringing it back right now. Oos, no, nobody home. I'm right, going to read the air dodge. Oh, he went for three. Yeah, he tried to fall him off stage. Try to go for the, near, the fair trade. Nobody there, though. Yeah, good utilization of the dash, but he's going to get grabbed out of it. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh nice tipper from the back air. Try, again, nice going, going for high. And going for runoff uh, fair again. Surprisingly, no... And unsurprisingly, nobody home for the second time. Yeah, Salacious B. Crumb definitely knowing that he, he just wants to go straight off for the fair. So he's going to recover high. He's like, okay, not that time. Uh, oh, he's, he's nice. All right. All right, tries to go for the nair right now. Okay. Nice spacing. Good spacing from both these players right now, actually. So, like, yeah, like the major thing is that, um, so that Salacious B. Crumb is actually able to keep out. Um, nice parry, but doesn't get anything off of it. To stay right out of uh, tipper range. <laughs> That's the tipper. You know, I, commentator's curse. I, Come I, on. You know, you know man. It's been a while since I've been giving the commentator's curse. I, I apologize. <laughs> um, but right now, what I was noticing with um, Salacious B. Crumb in this matchup right now is that while Mojo is trying to get, trying to get, you know, into, into tipper range, optimal range, um, Salacious B. Crumb is actually just keeping, uh, keeping uh, Marth out with a, with some really good. Uh, with some really good spacing, just keeping himself right out of it, keeping him in the projectile range and the and the and a lot of that. Ooh. Ooh, that was a slick. Yes, I was just gonna say that was very slick movement. <laughs> but, but yeah, but the punish is working dodges. for both of them. Good spot dodges on Mr. Mojo Rising. He really does have the momentum in his favor. He's gonna we'll go off an air edge guard. No, he's gonna sit back on stage again. Man, that is just sick. And all right, again. I feel like if Salacious. Can edge guard him low because Mojo is going low a almost lot. every time. He, I think so if he could just run off fair, that could be the game, and he could steal this. Yeah, he really could steal this right now. But the major, and, but the major thing right now, yeah, and that's another thing I'm noticing that um, Slash B Crumb is not doing. He's not covering the de the lower option. Goes for the Trump. God. <laughs> yeah, Inkling is very good at edge guarding. He's not really utilizing it. He's kind of just staying back on stage, playing a conservative. Like, oh my God, that was supposed to be a grab. I know, I felt that in my heart. Ooh, okay. Oh my god. This remember this was the percent he started. Oh my god, yeah, last game. But let's see if Mojo is able to make some sort of like make some sort of uh change here. He's gotta start going ham. He's get in his face to where he can't get tipper. Get yeah, so cause Marthitis is even worse in this game in like games like melee. Oh my god, he's missing he the grab! It again. It's unfortunate, but gets the down throw. Oh no, but he's safe, he's safe, up he's still broken. <gasps> Dash attack? Grenade? Oh no, oh, that's it! Because it's Tipper. Oh, unfortunate. It was a good showing. It was he a good stuff. It, but but Mojo Mr. Mojo Rising is going to take it right now.